what is cactus plant cactus are plants found in extremely hot environments such as deserts in fact no other plants are able to tolerate the extreme heat and the lack of water in these environments so how do cactus survive in deserts Unlike other plants, a cactus has special adaptations in its roots, leaves as well as stems enabling it to thrive in hot and dry environments. What are adaptations? Adaptations are the changes in structure or behavior of an organism that will allow the organism to survive in its habitat. Let's discuss the main adaptations of cactus plant. In this video, we are going to discuss five main adaptations of cactus and do watch till the end for a fun fact on cactus. Before we begin, please subscribe to Learny Day. First adaptation of cactus, spines. In cactus, the leaves are modified into spines. The spines prevent excess evaporation since water is less in a desert. Hence, the process of photosynthesis is not carried out by the leaves, but the stems perform this process. The desert also has herbivores that might want to eat cactus, but cannot because of the presence of spines. Observe how the spines of this cactus plant look like. Next, Roots of Cactus Plant Cacti or cactuses have shallow and wide roots close to the surface to quickly absorb rainwater. Shallow roots means they are not very deep. The desert is a dry place but it does experience rainfall occasionally and to collect rainwater from the ground, these plants have shallow roots that usually cover a large area to absorb water. So what are the advantages of shallow roots? As already discussed, the roots stay close to the soil surface to absorb rainfall, gather more nutrients and get established faster. Shallow roots enable cacti to survive drought and nutrient poor climates for several years. Next comes the stem of cactus plant. Cactus stems are fleshy and green because the plant needs to store a lot of water to survive in the desert. Thus, the stem of cactus aids in water storage as well as photosynthesis is also performed by stems. Next is the waxy skin. A waxy layer covers most of the plant's surface. This helps the plant to avoid excess evaporation as well as retain moisture. This waxy coating on their stems is called cuticle. It also reflects light to help the plant from overheating. The stomata of cactus plants. Since cacti don't have true leaves, their stomata are in the body of the plant or the stem and the cactus's stomata open only at night to take in carbon dioxide. Cooler nighttime temperatures mean that these plants lose far less water through open stomata. Cactus and many desert plants have very small stomata and fewer stomata than other plants to reduce the water loss. So to summarize, the five main adaptations of cactus plants are thick stem to store water, they have a waxy coating, they have less stomata that open only at night, their leaves are modified or changed to spines and they have shallow widespread roots. Now coming on to an interesting fun fact on cactus. Some cacti can live up to 200 years despite harsh desert conditions. So surely they can survive a few years in your household too. Hope you enjoyed learning about the adaptations of cactus plants. Do like the video and subscribe to Learny Day for more such knowledge videos.